I think it's time for the next system test with my Kitta FX-64 fire alarm control panel. This is the realistic fire alarm system that I have installed in the garage, also called the SER. And I'm going to show you the alarms that I have installed today. For a pull station, this manually activates the fire alarm system if I needed to. This is an FCI MS6. It's an older pull station, but I think it looks great sitting there. It looks exactly how you would think a pull station would look. Going up, I do have a fire alarm sign that points to the pull station, just so you know it's more visible. And then we have an EST alarm. Now you're probably thinking, wait a minute, this is the exact same alarm that was in the last system test. Well, close. This is actually an EST horn strobe, not a chime strobe. A lot of these EST Genesis alarms, they all look pretty much the exact same, but they can be a lot different. So this is a horn strobe. And I do have a little piece of electrical tape on the inside of that horn, which makes it a lot quieter, which is nice. <laughs> On the far side of the garage, I began replacing this alarm with a strobe only, but then I realized it'd probably be better if I just left the chime strobe up from the last system test. So this is an EST Genesis chime strobe, the same one for the last system test. That trim plate that's around the alarm that says fire on it, that's actually an addition you can get with the alarm. It's not the full alarm itself. It doesn't come with the alarm usually. And I have one without the trim plate right here, and as you can see, without it, it's actually pretty small. It can pretty much fit in my hand. So these are very small alarms, but without that electrical tape on the inside, this one's actually pretty loud. The siren on the security system is disabled for this test, which means you'll be able to hear just the fire alarms that I have installed. And now I think it's time to go ahead and pull the MS-6 and activate the system. All right, and three, two, one. Now this strobe is a fixed 75 candela strobe and I've found the higher the strobe candela is, which is the brightness, the harder it is for the camera to pick up. Now you would think that the brighter it is, the easier it is for the camera to pick up, but it's kind of reversed. And then the other strobe is multi candela, which means you can switch around the settings. And that strobe is set on the lowest setting, which is 15 candela. So that one's on 15. And this one over here is on 75. And as you can see, it's really loud. You can kind of hear it clicking. Looking at the inside of the pull station, as you can see, it is a Fire Control Instruments MS6. And there's the sticker, so you can see it. To reset it, you just lift the handle back up, and then you need a special key. You just put the key in, and then lock the station back up. And now it's reset and back to normal. To realarm the system, the smoke detector that's up here on the ceiling has not been tested in a while, so we're going to go ahead and use some canned smoke and set it off. Make sure it's working.
All right, and let's go ahead and give the panel a reset. And that'll take about a minute for the system to shut everything down. All right, the system, as you can read on the screen, is back in normal condition. And then we also have to reset the security system. And you do that just by punching in the passcode and then pushing off and then doing that twice. And yes, I don't have a problem showing you guys the password just because it's really more of a demonstration thing at this point. But uh, yeah, and then one more thing I'd like to do with this system, with the fire alarm system. Haven't done this in a while. You see there's a button there that says lamp test on it. If you push it, it will light up all of the lights on the screen so you can make sure they're working. So we're gonna go ahead and do a lamp test. Here we go. And I think it's working great. All right, good to know. I'm gonna go ahead and lock back up the panel. And thank you for watching this video. Rate, comment, and subscribe. Definitely go check out some of the other videos I have. And have a great day, everyone.